Well, we are honoring Hispanic Heritage Month. If you enjoy listening to live music, socializing, yeah. and also moving to the beat of different Latin music styles, a local bowling alley is where you should be every <laughs> Tuesday night. All right, Seth. Michaela Romero takes us to Rock and Bowl, where locals and visitors come together to enjoy a piece of Hispanic heritage. If you're not getting that strike or spare, why not try your hand or feet at something new? And we all come here. Sometimes it's a live band, sometimes it's a DJ, and we dance. Darren Meyer, one of the many locals who comes here every Tuesday night, showed me how to do the bachata. Although he loves bachata, Meyer says he loves to let loose on the dance floor with all types of music and people. It, it, it feels good, but you have to practice. And we all dance with each other every week and learn from different people. Everybody dances different. He started dancing in 2012, but he was no fancy footstepper. Just move to the music. Like Meyer, Brenda Malera, the editor in chief of Que Pasa newspaper, says she feels like dancing keeps Hispanic traditions alive. We should take that opportunity to also educate our young Latinos about who we are and where we came from and how important it is to continue our traditions and our culture. New Orleans is a melting pot and music has no borders. And even in an unexpected spot like a bowling alley, in the Hispanic culture, there's always a reason to dance. Is that it? Michaela Romero, WGNO News. All right, we'll continue highlighting Hispanic heritage through October 15th. Yeah, be sure to watch our Hispanic Heritage Special. That's going to be Friday, October 14th at 6.30 on WGNO. Then again, Saturday, October 15th at 9.30 on NOLA 38.